guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 10 of AI Camp. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Ice cream. Why the heck are y'all going at ice caves? This sounds like at the beginning of a horror movie. Yeah, this is definitely, like, beginning like a horror flick. Table cloth. <laughs> they left the camera. Exactly. Poor Kirby. It'll be okay. All right. Hmm. Only Kirby would lose these two. Oh my god. Finally. Oh, Thank you, God. And honestly, she's just wearing a hair down too, even though I like her other. <laughs> oh. You want to come with? I got this stamp on! <laughs> oh, yay! <laughs> I'm happy. We ain't got to see the other thing anymore. <laughs> Our little notepad. <laughs> I mean, the notepad, it, it was time for it to go. Look at that. Look how pretty that looks. Even though they had, to <laughs> they had to cut it out. And they probably glued it or taped it. But, like, but hey, look, there's two full, like, rows now. We're happy. I'm glad we're in with the one to return it. But then it's like, how in the world did she know she was going to go there? Oh, pfft, social media or something. Unless, you know, because of the fact is the thing that. Aki uh, said in the beginning just was a thing for a whore. Maybe Nadeshko probably put something on the internet and they all follow each other on Instagram or Twitter or I don't know. I don't know if I can finish, but so maybe like Instagram or Twitter. One of the two things. Maybe even Snapchat. Maybe Snapchat is exists in this world. You never know. I mean, come on. It's social media. Anything could exist in anime. They make like knockoff copies. And anime and they're so freaking cute. But I'm happy that Rin was the one to return it because... Obviously, we all kind of knew that coming into when it got lost, that Rin was going to be the only one who was going to be able to return it. But I love you. She has the stamp book back, and she only really has four more to go. And we only have this up to the ten. Four more weeks for the show. I think technically really three, but then you still have the extra, the special episode. So maybe the last stamp is going to be in the special episode. I'm not 100% sure with this. But, mm, I wish it really did. 
still short as hell, but still, I, I love the horror story aspect because, you know, as someone who likes the shit out of horror movies, like, mm. but <laughs> it, to me, in a way, it kind of looked like, a, um, they don't really, I mean, this used to be really popular. I don't know how popular they are now. I don't think they're as popular. It felt like a found footage type film with the way it was filmed and everything. Which is interesting, because like, like I said, found footage films, when we were, when it was like the 2010s, they were popular as heck. Like between 2009, from the start of 2009 to maybe 20... twenty sixteen or whenever the last Paranormal Activity movie came out, but like, there are still some companies that still like to do some found footage films, but it just depends, but the horror found footage type films those are gone. They still kind of do found footage, but not really for horror as much as I know. But yeah, other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode 10 of Hey I Camp. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Monday for episode 11. Bye, guys.